In your entertainment this week, Desert Trip, the classic rock festival coming in the fall, has been dubbed Coachella for old people. The recently announced event has planned performances from Paul McCartney, Bob Dylan, the Rolling Stones, Neil Young, The Who, and Roger Waters of Pink Floyd. It's scheduled to run from October 7th through 9th at the Empire Polo Club in Indio, California. Indio is also the location of the popular Coachella Valley Music and Arts Festival, which has led many to dub Desert Trip Coachella for Old People or Old Cella. Three-day passes start at $399 for general admission with reserved seating going for as much as $1,599. Tickets go on sale Monday on deserttrip.com. Actress Christina Applegate is battling insomnia, revealing she averages just three hours a night. The 45-year-old star admits the sleep disorder has taken a toll on her health, personality, and well-being. Christina first started experiencing insomnia in her mid-20s, and she admits the birth of her daughter, Sadie Grace, in 2011 really upset her sleep patterns. Here are her rules to help her sleep. Keeping her bedroom at a chilly 60 to 68 degrees, making sure TVs and cell phones are turned off, and even persuading her husband, Martin Lenoble, to use a straw when he drinks water in the night to cut down on the sound when he gulps. Will Ferrell has reportedly abandoned plans to play President Reagan after outcry over portraying the former world leader when he had dementia. The former Saturday Night Live cast member was set to star as President Ronald Reagan in the planned Reagan film. The story begins at the start of the ex-president's second term when he falls into dementia and an ambitious intern is tasked with convincing the commander-in-chief that he is an actor playing the president in a movie. But the comedy project did not go over well with some who take exception to such a portrayal of Reagan, who had Alzheimer's disease in his later years. This has been your entertainment this week. I'm Alicia Cook for News 46.